fellow viewers, and today I'm going to be doing another Halo Mega Block scene review. This is when the cavern has pushed the UNSC down by using their massive ships and destroyed every base possible. And they've only got this little thing left. Alright, let's go. This is the smallest part you'll be shown. It's just the left side of the Hornet. As you can see, they've got five people there. The White Marine, the Blue Marine, the Green Marine, and I think it's the White Pilot Marine, and the Invisible Brute, which is going to fight, like, check out if, or what's happening over here, and if he can, like, attack now, basically. Next, I've got the Hornet, and it's probably my best, my favourite part. That's awesome. And it also does like the machine gun part as well and everything. But it's really weird because you have to aim it at a certain angle, so you have to like lift it up and then you press the button and then it works. Which is cool. Of course the wings do work. All the way around and you can move it left and right, which is cool. I didn't know you could do that so Cool, and you've got your pilot there. So it's good. It's got a good detail of the Hornet. It's the most updated Hornet so far. All right, next part. This is another little. So this is a big part of going like of that. These three Spartans are like arguing over what to do because the Odyssey has been broken down to a small little base, and there's not nothing much to do. So they're arguing over what to do. Obviously, this Bloom button thinks he knows everything. He's probably the like the best level of Spartan out of all of them. That's good. And if we move on a bit, we've got the Invisible Grunt, which is also checking the premises of you know what's left of the UNSC. If we move on a little bit more, there's the other marine off the cyclops flat. The cyclops flat. <laughs> I can't speak. I'm sorry about that. And he's just talking to the recruit. Which is cool. And he's just chilled out. He's not worried about anything. Move to the back. There's. He was a flame flower, but now he's a medic. Um, a medic. And he's trying to get the UNSC recruit center working so he can. Um, See if there's any more you want to see less, and if they can like regroup here. And then next to him is like a captain, just like talking over and stuff. Not, not much there. Alright, let's move up again. Right, this isn't actually Halo Mega Box. This is just uh, a ship I made. I didn't. I just thought it would be good because I didn't. I don't know because I didn't have any many ships. Which are you gonna see? I've got like two. The other one wouldn't be able to take anything. That one's weak. That's my other ship. So you, it's only one person. If you have one, one man ship, you can do much with it. So I, I just thought I'd build something. Right, let's go back. So this is the ship which took most of the troops. Well, it took all of the troops actually. Actually, it took all the troops you see. Apart from that troop which the Hornet took and the Hornet also took something else and you'll find out in a minute. But this white marine is just like, you know, trying to fix it up. After having to go through all of the covenant. And as you see the guns do work. Well they don't work but they move. There's that one at the back. But then they don't look similar which kinda of ruins it. But never mind. And this is the play box which the Hornet took, and if I move the Marine, I need to get him off, Boop. and put it down, sorry about that, yep. the boxes are actually full of like stuff, the first box has a grenade, a sandbag, grenade launcher, SMG, uh, bubble shield, 
like you thing. Backpack. Another grenade launcher off Halo 4. And I don't know what that weapon's called. It sounds like the DMR. Basically, basically it's just the DMR, but that's like more powered. Kind of overpowered. So that's what's in the biggest crate. So I can just put all of it back. So we went to the smaller crate. The next crate has not, not anything, not much. All it has is the pieces to make <coughs> the jetpack. But you have to break it down to little pieces. And this. It's just like a little nice thing. So that, oh, what, that tiny little crate actually holds. Let's put that back. It's hard to put stuff back in these tiny little boxes. Let's move it. Let's put the lid on this. And let's move it back up. So yeah, that's what the um, crates hold. That's and the green um marine is just checking out if it's all good and stuff. The last section is the grunt, the last little grunt, invisible grunt, which is good. He starts. He, I think he's planning to kill this marine when nobody's looking. That's his plan. So that's, see, that's their actual plan is to find out if they can take anybody out without anybody else noticing, noticing because you know they'll probably get shot down by like tons of gunfire because they won't because they're like Spartans what know where the invisible guys are. That has been basically it. That's the last of the um, review. Well seen. Thanks for watching. This is JGamer112 and goodbye.